If My People 2012 would like to introduce Dave Kabul, minister, former vice president of Fellowship of Christian Athletes and president of Intercessors for America. Today, Dave will be leading us in prayer for the president. Hi, this is Dave with Intercessors for America. Today we pray for the president. You know, we're just a few days away from one of the most important elections in the history of our nation, and campaigns are in full swing. The polls are up and down, and it's uh, every commercial seems to be a political commercial. Well, today as we pray for the president, I want us to be encouraged by three things. Number one, we need to pray for civility. It is so easy to have tense conversations with fellow believers or even unbelievers in this day and age. And I think we as the church need to lead in civil civility and to uh, treat each other with love. In addition to that, I really want us to really have hope today. We don't have hope in, in a, a man who sits in an office or, or a, a switch in a political campaign or party or whatever. We have hope in the God of nations, that He will direct our nation in the course that He desires. And lastly, I really want us to pr be praying that believers will not be complacent in this day and age. Uh, it's so easy to think that our vote doesn't count. Um, I, we really need to, uh, to fight against that and pray against that. So today, as we pray for our president I'll share with you one scripture it's proverbs chapter 21 verse 1 a king's heart is a water channel in the lord's hand he directs it wherever he chooses lord jesus we come before you today and lord we lift before the before you the presidency of the united states of america lord god we pray number one for the president that is in office today. Lord, we pray that you would bless him on this day. Lord, we pray that you would bless his family. Lord, you created that man and you have a design and purpose for that man. And we pray that every plan that you have to use that man would come to pass. In addition to that, Lord Jesus, we pray for this election, Lord, that you would grant us, not because we deserve it, but because we are simply humbly asking for a God-fearing leader. Lord, we pray that for the presidency of the United States of America, that they would dispense justice and truth throughout our land. Lord God, we pray for a president that would fight for religious liberties for all within our country. Lord Jesus, we lift before you the presidency of the United States of America. Thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I hope you are very encouraged by praying and fasting for this country during these 40 days of If My People. And let me just encourage you to continue to pray. Don't stop. If My People 2012. Thank you for praying for our nation. Please continue to pray for today's prayer topic throughout the day. We encourage you to share this video with others who may want to participate in the 40 days of prayer for America. If you would like to view previous day's videos, please visit www.ifmypeople2012.org. If My People 2012 would like to thank Dave Kabul for his voluntary participation in praying for America. For more information about Dave or Intercessors for America, you may contact ifapray.org.